I don't know if it's wise to come here. Should I park here? I mean, I really want to go to Second Cup. Guys, there's literally like a Tesla thing here. And, uh, well, I'll explain it in a second when I go inside. Okay. See ya. I made it to Second Cup. A little shaken up. But this is my favorite place. So, let's go in. What do you guys have? You usually I go for caramel caretto and the stuff looks really good. Okay. Uh, can I please get, I'll take, is that how you said, okay, monster brownie. Monster brownie. And I'll take the iced fudge brownie. Mm -hmm. okay. What do I want for drinks? Your drink's like really hard because I've tried a few and I really like them. <laughs> so I'm like, God, which one? So much sugar, but whatever, it's morning. So <laughs> I will have the Caramel Coretto, please. I'll take a medium. Let's do it. There you go. Thank you. You're welcome. And then I guess I'll wait. But... Yeah. Thank you. Awesome. Thank you. Which is the cutest one? Hey guys, how's it going? I'm Paris. Welcome to my channel, or welcome back to my channel. If you're new, make sure you hit that like and subscribe and turn the bell to get notifications. And if you're already subscribed, thanks for supporting the channel. Story time, guys. I have to tell you, like, I came here to Second Cup and I love this place. Um, I got some good stuff. Like, it's really hot today, but I had like a brownie. Cute. And I got like a monster cookie. Isn't it delicious? I'm gonna devour it. Um, I'm gonna eat this in a second. I'm just waiting for my drink, which I'm excited for. Uh, yeah, so guys, what happened was, well, I'll show you in a bit, but I'll explain it. So I went down to a tulip festival with my friend, like my best friend, you guys know about Lexi, and usually go with, like hang out with Lexi and like Buster. Oh, perfect, thank you. You're welcome. You're awesome. Yeah, anyway, so we usually hang out, but this time we went to like the Tulip Festival, which is like this really fun festival full of like flowers and exciting like attractions. Like there's hot dog stands and like special like ice creams and stuff like that. So yeah. yeah. So we went there, we checked out the place and we had a feeling someone was following us. So this is what happened. Hi guys, how's it going? Hey, I'm Lex. So you guys have met him before. And we are here just exploring the city. How have you been? Things are awesome here. It's so warm. I'm in my short sleeve. You can see my arms. It's like 30 degrees today. It feels like summer. Yeah. I don't think we're supposed to walk on that. We walk we walked on this. I hope nothing happens because it's like now we're like breaking rules and we literally just started and we started uh, off breaking rules. You probably killed some ants. <laughs> you think so? I wonder what's going on here. You I'm see, to the festival. Oh, is it? I'm seeing like a bunch of flowers, so probably. Yeah, it's really, really pretty. Yeah. Let's take a look around. Oh, that's nice. Is that like a stage? like a gazebo over there there's a few gazebos it's pretty cool i don't really see anything happening though you think we'll see anything like hmm there's I literally like so. nothing here there's barely any flowers i don't think it's even started yet well you can see them right here yeah but there are no lot there's mostly more right usually there's more of them see look this is what i mean it's barren legit like nothing in there I'm seeing that. <laughs> I don't know. I don't see a lot here. It's kind of sad. It's a cool statue. This isn't bad. Yeah, 
it still looks barren. I think we have to come back and actually see some. There's no way this is it for the Tulip Festival. Oh my god. What was that? I thought I saw something there. I thought I saw a clown. I'm so sure I saw a clown, but I don't know. Anyway. Yeah, so after that, like, we were, like, just being on edge on, like, you know, the lookout, making sure no one was, like, attacking us. And I think I saw a clown, or I'm pretty sure I saw a clown. But then you know what? Maybe I didn't. But uh, it looked like there was someone after us. And then I got to thinking, who could it be? Could it be Elon? Like, we didn't really want to say it because we're not too sure, right? Uh, so recently I got a car, and I got a Mercedes. And... What I wanted to do was I wanted to add some features to it because it's like a pretty beautiful car but sometimes you want to add some packages, upgrade it, you know, that type of thing. So what I did was I asked the, the dealership if they could add like the special feature that lets my car go on like autopilot or just drive itself and they said sure no problem we can add it for you. So they added this feature, the special package for me, they had the car shipped to me. And I made a few jokes with my friend because we're like, oh, it's self-driving, really fancy. It's not like, you know, a Tesla. And of course, like we were on the phone joking like 3 a.m. and things always like go wrong when you do basically anything at 3 a.m. And that's what happened. We were cracking some jokes like, oh, haha, <laughs> Mercedes is gonna put like, you, you know, like up, up a competition with like Elon. And we're just like going on and on. And then some, there was like a thump on my window. And that was just because I had a conversation with my friend. So, should I be worried? Because so we just decided to leave the location. But as we were going to leave, this happened. Yeah, I like it. Cool. job I did? Yeah, I know. Guys, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna head out of here because, well, I'm pretty I'm sure. Hungry. Yeah, you're hungry and I'm hungry too. So, uh, also, we think someone was following us, but we don't know. And we think we saw a clown. But yeah, so we're just gonna head out and find something to eat. Oh my god. <laughs> How do we get out of the way? Let's go, baby. That's so oh scary. God. I don't know, Red. I don't know, baby. Let's get out of here. He missed us. Are you okay? Are you okay? The fuck? I'm telling you, it's a clown. I'm telling you, it has to be a clown. I thought I saw one, but now it's like it's probably confirmed. But they're like gone now. So let's go. And that was really scary because I think that either Elon was trying to send someone to come and get us, or maybe. It's his twin, evil twin or something that tried to attack us or an imposter, not too sure. But somebody tried to run us over and that was a really scary experience, guys. What would you do? Like, would you just stay indoors? Of course, naturally, I thought like, yeah, I should stay indoors, but I didn't. I went out here to this lovely place instead to relax and hopefully everything will turn out fine.
this is how it went and we ended up leaving safely because it's like well we can't stay there we have to get out of here and watch out for our safety so we went to mcdonald's of course and then we had like this delicious meal hi guys so we made it and we're about to have some food Yay. we got tons of it look at that let's take a look at what we have okay what's in the bag it's a surprise <laughs> okay so excited okay we got napkins uh, look, it's a wooden fork. <laughs> it's wood <laughs> instead of plastic, so it's really good for the environment. Yeah, that's true. And and those are like uh, paper straw. I don't really I, like it. I don't like paper yeah. straws. But it's good for the environment. Yeah. Well, no, really. Like I'm still like shaken up because like we were leaving like the park and somebody like just came and tried to run us over. You know. Yeah, if only you have like a wooden fork to defend yourself, then you would make like... <laughs> yeah, but we don't, we don't condone violence, guys. <laughs> so, yeah. And, and this looks really good. Look at this. What is this? Like, this is like a flap or something? Yeah, it is. Yeah. They got my drink. And this is a poutine. Yay! Should I open it? Yeah, so show them. Should I jealous? Yeah! You guys are gonna be so jealous show of them. us. Show them! amazing so we got the tent and we got like our happy meal so we're all set and it's got like kung fu panda stuff on it really okay yeah are you gonna open it and i think yeah okay fine it looks like a bunch of like goodies so i got like my fries i got what is this like yogurt <laughs> Looks good, right? Nice and healthy. Yeah. Ooh, I got my nuggets. I'm so excited. Can you open that for me? Sure. Ah, uh, it's like golden da, 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 da. nuggets. They're so cute. Yes. Aren't they amazing, guys? We're gonna like devour this. Oh wait, there's something else in here. Oh my god. Yeah, but what is this? This is like Shigo or something. Like, what is this? Can possible toy? I don't know. Guys, I don't know what this is. <laughs> it looks so cute though. What does it say? It says Green Lantern toy. Okay, guys, I think it's a Green Lantern. So that's cool. Anything else? Oh, they forgot my dipping sauce. That's so annoying. That's crazy. It's not in there. That's annoying. Yeah. But you know what? I don't really want to go back because I was kind of scared because, like, they got it ordered wrong the first time or first few times. It's like, five minutes to get like extra get it and then it's like when you ask for like more napkins like, she was really angry so maybe she's like working with the person that was flying like the cloud or something like what do you think yeah it could be, it could be a yeah mm -hmm. i don't know i don't think i want to go for it so guys we're just gonna devour this food and when we're done we'll see you guys later and you know what i think maybe it was suspicious because this person kept giving us like the go around i think she tried to make it take longer than it should have to get our order not too sure everybody in front of us got their order before we did and we're like okay she seems kind of rude maybe she's working with clowns or something but you know what maybe she's working for elon who knows anyway guys so we got out of there too we were too afraid to ask for like you know like simple things like mayonnaise or whatever because we we're like well maybe she is working with them maybe she's a spy so we just booked it after we had a full meal and that's what happened to me anyway so <laughs> how's your weekend guys like what do you think about the tulip festival if you've been or if you've ever been to any sort of festival and what is the craziest thing that's ever happened to you guys write down in the comments and let me know because i'm still a little shaken up and of course my friend seems a little shaken up last i spoke to my friend anyway guys Thanks for subscribing. Make sure you guys hit that like and subscribe button. Thanks for paying attention to my story. I feel a lot better just talking about it, you know? That's what they teach you, like, birth therapy, birth therapeutic reasons. Just like talk about somebody and I felt like I could talk about it with you guys. So yeah, guys, Priesters out.